You're a young SeaWorld guest in much the same way myself and the other trainers were inspired on our first visits to SeaWorld. So with that, I've got a brand new friend joining me today. Hey, what's your name? Jessica, it is so nice to meet you. Now, Jessica, where are you from? Oh, oh, she's all the way from London, UK. Let's give her a big SeaWorld welcome. All right, Jessica, you and I have the awesome chance to show everyone today how we start to build bonds and relationships with the animals that we take care of. Now, in order to do that, you see my big, giant, cute friend over there? He's 700 pounds, almost 700 pounds, and we get to get real close to him to give him a good dolphin style hello. So let's take a couple more steps, maybe one or two, yeah. A little bit more, there is good, right up to that 24 foot drop off. Now, Jessica, when you and I first met, we shook hands, and that's a great way to meet him. But instead of shaking his hand, you get to shake his flipper. So Jessica, meet Starbuck, Starbuck, meet Jessica. Oh my goodness, Jessica, that was awesome. You know, one of my absolute favorite ways to start building relationships is with food. So take that fish, toss it right into Starbucks mouth. There we go, here's another one. I'm just gonna keep handing you these cause they go straight to his heart. So here's another one. And then let's do one for each hand this time. There we go. He just, he almost caught both of those, Jessica. That was a good toss. Um, uh oh, look at your hands. Do you see all those? Fish guts, smell them. Gross, so let me show you how Miguel and I get rid of those. First, we take our hands and we show them to Starbucks. We put them together, we rub them really fast, a little bit faster, in between those fingers, all over those hands, and then all over that dress. Um, yeah, that's gonna be a long flight back to the UK. <laughs> all right, Jessica, how about you kneel down? Uh, you and I are gonna give Starbucks here a nice, good back rub, so, He's gonna show us his back. He really seems to enjoy this, so go ahead, reach out. Give him some love. Now, Jessica, what does Starbuck feel like? He feels soft, yeah. He's very soft and smooth, and that helps him swim really fast through the water, but guess what? He's a little ticklish. Why don't you give him a tickle? Yeah, a little bit closer to the dorsal fin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Even 46-year-olds can be ticklish. He just got you soaked. We cannot let him get away with that. How about you reach in the water and splash him back? Yeah, just like that. Oh, Jessica, Jessica! I had no idea that was gonna happen. Here, give him this fish right there. All right, let's try something else. How about you stand up real tall? We're gonna see if Starbuck here wants to go on a really big jump. Ready? Face your body towards me, arms out wide. Look at Starbuck, is he looking back at you? Perfect, now clap one time, ready? One, two, three, clap! But look at Starbuck. Your arms out. One, two, three, clap. Yeah, check it out. Jessica, he saw you and this is just for you. Oh my goodness, Jessica, take this big old fish, toss it right in the Starbucks mouth. You know what kind of fish that is? Dead? Yeah. Um, these are dead fish. They are, these little guys are called capelid and dolphins like earth. The big ones are called herring. Dolphins like Starbuck eat over 20 pounds of fish every single day, Jessica. Here, here's a couple more. Go ahead and toss those in. Um, Uh-oh, yeah, one at a time, just as slow as can be. Keep going, yeah, uh-oh, look at your hands. Uh-oh, you remember how to get rid of them? Show them to Starbuck, put them together, rub them in between those fingers, all over those hands. Now what do we do? We gotta get them off, yeah. Yeah, um, you, wanna, you just wanna air dry them this time? Or we forgot to fix your hair, so why don't you fix those flyaways? There we go. All right, you know what? You have been amazing. This fish is for you. Well done, well done. No, okay. Go ahead, feed it to Starbucks, and I just have one more thing for you to do, and that's give your new friend a big wave goodbye. Everyone, that's Jessica and her new best friend, Starbucks. just went on a fun adventure. But what about you guys? Are you ready for some more? Yeah! Well, that's great because we still have an entire pod of dolphins to discover, but discovery can also lead to risk. Dolphins are innately curious and in the ocean this could lead them to explore polluted areas or even play with trash. So what can we all do to help? Simple things can have big impacts. Recycle, 
Join a beach cleanup. Be sure to properly discard a fishing line and plastic bottles. Better yet, choose reusable items and reduce the amount of waste we all produce. Small actions like these can go a long way to protecting ocean life. Travis and I are just two of over 350 zoological professionals on the SeaWorld team. Collectively, not only do we provide world-class care for these dolphins, but we have facilitated in the rescue of over 40,000 animals with the goal of rehabilitating and returning these animals to their natural habitat. And that's all because of you. Your visit today matters, and without your support, we wouldn't be able to do this good work and save wildlife that need our help. So on behalf of our entire animal care team, we'd like to say thank you. So we care for our world and take action on behalf of the animals that call us home. That's part of the legacy we're leaving behind. And that legacy is one worth celebrating. Sea World Orlando is celebrating an extraordinary milestone. 60 years.